we have Gabe here. Gabe, we've welcomed on the show several times as well, and he's done amazing work with our downtown community, especially with the South by Southwest initiative. And yeah, I, I see you guys gearing up to go down to that soon, so I'm sure you're really busy. However, we're not actually going to be talking about that initiative this time. I hear rumors of a new little group get together happening in Las Vegas? Uh, yeah, well, it's not a rumor. It is, in fact, true. Sure. Uh, so um, th I think the first thing I want to point out is it's uh, called Homebrew LV. And Homebrew is basically an opportunity for this community to re-engage each other individually on a more frequent basis. There's been so many developments over the past year, two years, in the, in the tech community overall that we thought you know, you get segmented with all our individual pursuits, but we wanted to keep the interaction amongst the individual smaller communities under the larger globe. Mm -hmm. And so we started Homebrew LV. Now, the one thing I want to point out is Homebrew, Homebrew LV is not something that I am uh, an organizer of. I'm a small part of it. I don't own it. Uh, basically, what happened is uh, a couple people that are concerned members of the community saw a void and thought that we weren't interacting as much as we used to. We wanted to have something that the community owned. So, uh, Pavel, who is obviously on the of Downtown course. Podcast, and Mark Johnson uh, with Wedgies, and Adam Kramer, who works at Switch, uh, and I got together for coffee one day and said, how can we bring the community together more frequently to interact? Because we have Ruby Group and iOS Meetup and Jelly that's starting to revive. Yeah, we things. kind of segment into our own little silos. Yeah, sometimes. and these are, these are good developments, right? These mm -hmm. are things that show community growth, but we still think it's important to have in real life interaction. Um, this is how we stay connected to each other, both, you know, obviously in the online world, but in mm -hmm. real life, we want to stay connected and find out what's happening in the community. So this is a bi, uh, we're going to do it twice a month, basically. Mm -hmm. Our first meeting is on the 18th of February. We're going to be announcing the location details next week. Um, the biggest thing that I wanted to, to point out, or the too long didn't read version, is <laughs> co-work, chat, and do amazing things. And those are the three goals of what we want to do. It, 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 it's not me. If you individually want to do something, this mm -hmm. is an opportunity for the community to rally amongst each other and help each other, find out how we can get together and help each other achieve whatever it is with our startups or community initiatives. Um, again, I can't stress this enough. This is not my thing. I'm just trying to help out as another community person. This is a platform for the entire community to get together. It sounds like there may be some synergy for us to kind of work together, which is awesome. Um, and these are the kind of crossovers that we need to learn. And we think that Homebrew LV is a good opportunity to start communicating. This this is really fabulous, and I'm I'm biased because I love you and Adam and Pavel and Mark. You know, you guys well, we are kind of my too, favorites. Of course, of course. <laughs> um, but but I'm really excited to see where this goes, having like a self-owned, self-organized community. So, yeah. where can people find out more about this? So right now, you can go to homebrewlv.com, or you can also go to facebook.com/homebrewlv. That's kind of where we're gathering right now. The first meeting on the 18th is really about finding out from the community what they think we need, and us as a community rallying together to build those. Things. So this one especially is an important meetup. Very, very time. important. Yeah, the 18. This is an opportunity for you to chime in and start to put one foot in front of the other with respect to what we're going to build together. Awesome. Super excited about it. Great. And I've seen uh, Mark designing the logo, and it's yes. like so fantastically very 80s homebrew. So I'm like so <laughs> excited about it. So yeah. yeah, I think it was important in the messaging when we're sitting around having coffee talking about it. Like yeah. Home, somebody, I don't remember who brought it up, but somebody's like homebrew, and we're like, yes, <laughs> definitely homebrew. I love it. It reminds you of Super Happy Dev. Um, Mm -hmm. What is this Super Happy Dev House? Which right, is this is what we're talking about earlier, the, the, yeah. the, the developer Yes, yeah, California, yeah, yeah. Right. So it's very similar to that, so that's why I'm excited. So yeah, everyone needs to get down to that. And can you please thank my awesome community guests this week? They did a, a great job of talking about their initiative. Thank you.